Hey guys, Tugcar back again here for another little update, I suppose, for the collection. Uh, I got a lot of good feedback for the last video. Uh, so far, I believe we're at 14 subscribers, or maybe 15 now, and about 70 views, and it's been a day and a half, I believe, since I posted it. So, really good uh, support from the community, I appreciate it. And a lot of people seem to like the video, so, like I promised, I'll come back and I'll do some more videos like this. Uh, Today I really wanted to keep it short so that you guys didn't really have to sit and listen to me basically speak a novel for you guys. But uh, on my list that I have to my left, basically all we're going to discuss today, uh, I'm going to show you my, my Ryan Suckup collection that I've kind of gotten going. And I still have some more stuff that I look to get. It's not done, it's just kind of something I do on the side, it's nothing serious really. Uh, but it is a little collection I do. And also we'll talk about something specifically for Instagram members. It'll be uh, the Blue Collar Collectors Union that I'm a part of on Instagram. Nothing really big, it's just kind of something we do. So that's just kind of something extra as well as we will take a sneak peek into my Contenders collection. And also I'll just talk a little bit about the Facebook community and what I've kind of gotten from there. I'll make a whole separate video about the Instagram community and my thoughts on that because a lot of people know that I do have a lot of thoughts on the Instagram community. But we'll get to that in another video. Uh, let's start this video up. We will start with the uh, suck up collection. It's really small. I'm thankful that a lot of people in the community have been gracious enough to give me a lot of these for free actually. Uh, as most of this I didn't really have to go out and get because people were willing to just give them to me and that's, that means a lot because I mean suck up isn't a big guy but people know that I am a big Chiefs fan so uh, first off we'll start with both of these and I did my first box break and it was funny I was talking to my friend and uh, I was watching the video and I paused it and I was like, wow, best hit in the whole break. And I got a, I got a Ryan Suckup base card, actually. One of these that I'm showing you right now in a pack. I thought that's cool because I only have two base cards. So, I mean, it's kind of something. I mean, I'm willing to add more. Uh, this one right here, it's a base card, but it doesn't have the name on the bottom. And uh, I believe there's something different as well on it somewhere. It doesn't have the name and it doesn't have that it's a kicker. So, a short print there. Uh, I did find out it is considered a short print. I looked online. Uh, now I have the gold out of 2014. Really nice, I got this for free. Uh, really cool card. I got it for free from a guy off of Facebook. And then I have two pinks right here. Uh, one of them was given to me for free in a deal that I made and another one I had gotten off of eBay. Uh, both out of $4.99 if you look. Really nice cards. Really nice cards. I like the pink border, pink breast cancer awareness. I wanted piece, there was a uh, game used memorabilia of him from October, it was pink wristband, and I, it was autographed, I really wanted it, I think it might still even be up on eBay, but he wants like 50 bucks, so I'll pass on that, but uh, right here, another thing, I believe I did pay for this one on eBay, uh, it's the orange out of 96, I believe, and this one's not printed on, which is kind of weird, you notice how these others are printed on, uh, this, let's see right here, it's printed, and this one's actually 26 out of 96, but it's actually engraved in there, so that's really cool as well. Uh, next, another gift that I received, and this one is not printed on there, or is printed on there, uh, it's the black, a gift I received from a friend on Instagram, really nice guy, and this I had, this was my first Ryan Suckup I had, I just found it, I had it in my Chiefs collection, uh, it's his, considered his rookie card, because it was his first card he's had made, so really cool there. And just recently, a guy on Instagram gave me an in-person autograph, uh, that, they had gotten from training camp in about 2011, 2010, sometime like that. Uh, really cool, and he was willing to give it to me for free. Really nice guy, so uh, no COA, but I, I eventually, once I get more money, I'll probably end up sending a couple things to get COAs on him. But really interesting card, and it's actually probably my favorite card that I have just because it's the only autograph I have of him. So that's really the, uh, the suck-up collection. I told you to be short. But it's just something I figured I'd show y'all. I mean, it's it's not Odell Beckham. It's not. It's something. It's my own thing. It's kind of a. I'm one of those guys that I don't like showing off things that a bunch of people have. Uh, I think that suck up collection is really unique and something that not many people do. So, kind of a first time showing something that you might go, oh, you know, maybe get some ideas on anything you want to do. But uh, next, we'll just kind of talk a little bit about a thing that I'm a part of on Instagram. the It's newly started up, the Blue Collar Collectors Union. Uh, it's nothing really big, it's nothing like super important, it's just kind of something, something that we do. Uh, 
it's basically a page that shows all the major collections on Instagram. It's really cool. It's really fun. Uh, I'm the co the co creator of it, I guess. Uh, the creator of it. I don't know if he wants his Instagram name taken out. It's someone that I really don't have much contact with much. But ever since we started this together, it's been we've been good friends. Uh, I'm pulling it up on Instagram. You can see it, the BCCU official page right there on Instagram. I mean, it shows some of the top collections. Uh, really cool. Like there's someone's Beckham Jr. Uh, I know mine's down here somewhere. My Nile collection that I've got going. Uh, and I mean, just a bunch of bunch of cool stuff. The logo. That's the logo. Uh, just really, really something cool. If you're on Instagram and you want to see a lot of really good collections and you want to see what you can, uh, what you can achieve, I thought that was something really cool to look at and kind of get an idea of uh, some decent collections. Now, I'm not saying those are all super collections. I'm not saying anybody on that page is necessarily a super collection, but uh, definitely a lot of really nice collections out there. Some of them are worthy, uh, like T. Austin Collectors. Uh, she's got a really nice collection and. I don't think 12 Lucky's on there yet, but he's nice. But a lot of really nice collections that I would love to see on that page from members that join. And uh, like I said, you're free to join. I'm not forcing you to. Some people don't like uh, like the idea. Some people do, and that's their own opinion. I'm not going to form someone's opinion based on something that they don't want to agree with. And I mean, that's fine with me. I'm not, I'm not pressing anybody, of course. But anyways, that's enough of that. Just thought maybe I'd enlighten some of you on that. Uh... Next up, we'll do this. Just a little sneak peek into my contenders. And go right here. Take out half of my Nile collection. Uh, if you don't know, this is what my what my setup looks like. It's pretty nice. It's nice. It's it's nice. I like it. It shows off the collection well. Uh, I got my arc of good cards going and my rainbow but uh this will be a whole separate video it's just kind of a sneak peek uh i have these three boxes back here i don't know if you see those three boxes uh 2013 2012 and i think a couple 2011 on the bottom it might even be empty i'm not sure i can't remember but uh this is just 2014 uh some of the stuff that i have I, I mean, I don't really collect Kadeem Carey. They were the last things I had put in the box, but I mean, I got a lot of nice contenders. I don't really have them in really any order. I just have my nicest on top, but we'll get more into that in another video. You guys will have plenty of time to enjoy that. Uh, and really, for the most part, I don't have much else to say. I was going to talk about the Facebook community. I might save that for the next video just because we're at eight minutes. And I feel like y'all's attention span's running out, uh, unless I start showing some Odell Beckham patches, or uh, which I don't have. I don't really have a whole bunch right now outside of PC. And uh, I actually just ordered a lot of non-PC stuff. I won a really interesting thing. For those of you who don't know, I just participated in my first box break not long ago. And uh, I didn't get a whole bunch. I had the Steelers. I didn't get a bunch. But I actually got the... Uh, in my next box break, I got a 10-box mixer, and I got the Bengals, and the guy gave me the Chiefs, actually, for 10 bucks on a 10-box mixer, which was nice. And uh, I ended up pulling a Jeremy Hill booklet, three-color booklet, out of 25 from Playbook, and uh, that's really nice. I think I might have sold it for 30 already. I could be wrong, depending on if my friend decides to buy. And I uh, also got Aaron Murray, Aaron Murray Auto and uh, DeAnthony Thomas Auto, as well as like one or two other hits. So it's it was nice, it was really nice, and I was thoroughly happy about it for it being my second break. I thought it was pretty decent luck, but uh, I think I'll end the video here. Nine minutes and about 40 seconds will be a, enough time for you guys to view, and I appreciate you guys sticking around as usual, and I hope you guys uh, can like and subscribe this. Uh, I'm not really doing this for any channel views, I just am doing it so that you guys can enjoy and kind of see my collection from a speaking perspective instead of... Uh, pictures that's always nice because i like to i like to be able to kind of communicate with you guys in a way and i feel like talking even though right now i'm talking to my wall i feel like talking to you guys over this is kind of a way of connecting and i know that you guys a lot i'm i'm well liked on instagram so a lot of you guys have actually looked up to me and uh, i guess in a way that's just kind of giving back because it means a lot to me and uh, what you guys have actually done to help me with my collection like i started out with base cards and uh, 
what, eight months later, here we are, so, uh, as usual, I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope to see you guys very soon, next time we'll go over my Contenders collection, or something along that line, so, until then, Todd Muffin out, guys, you guys have a great night.